All right, welcome back to another Haven Rose video. I'm Henry, this is Sam. Today we are discussing our locks and we're doing, talking about some of the, about the Odell Beckham situation. Let's get right into it. Alright, so before we get into this video, make sure to like, subscribe, make sure that notification bell is on so you get notified whenever we post a new video. And right now, <coughs> a good comment in the comment section. Thank you for 5,300 views on our last shorts. And welcome yeah, that's to, pretty cool, actually. Yeah, and welcome to the 10 new people who subscribe. Um, Alright, so let, let's talk about Odell very quick, okay? Our main focus is going to be our locks, but still. Odell Beckham... Uh, over the weekend, got really. Can I mention the fact that you, we had to do this twice, real quick? Yeah, this is our okay, second so, time recording. So Henry forgot to the first time. We don't know what happened, so the video just, just stopped. Off. So I was like, all right, let's do it again. Henry uh, then proceeded to start another video. Henry didn't clear out his phone. I would like to mention he's over a thousand videos, uh, videos and photos. It's because this YouTube channel like all the videos downloaded. They, so. Then get rid of them when you're done. Exactly. Like it's not that hard. Um, all right, so let's. Well, let's, no, no, no <laughs> let me get there. And so that got corrupted. And now we were going to talk about a bunch of other things, but I don't have time for that. I got to get to bed. And then there I was supposed early. to be a football video today, but the footage from that got mixed up and everything. So, so yeah, everything's weird. Um, All right, so. But. OBJ, his top five teams right now are the Niners, Patriots, Saints, Packers, Seahawks. His number one is the Seahawks, but he could go any of those. I don't teams. think it's number one Seahawks. It, like, it, no. It, they may when I say season. it's number one Seahawks, he like he said that. Oh. Like I, I'm not I'm not BSing. Like he I, said I, that. I, 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 like where do you think I'm getting this from? Do you, is it just like trust me, bro? Trust me. No, I, right, I, this right, is right, serious. Right. Like so, listen. Of course, Saints fans, we want him to come to N New Orleans, we, especially after Deontay Harris suspension. Oh my gosh, we need him so bad. He's been suspended, bro. I want to make sure I have all the details correct. I'm not exiting Bro, on this page. We need him so bad. After Deontay has got a DWI, like, first of all, Deontay, let me have a one on one chat with you for a second. You're irresponsible in the first place for getting a DWI. Oh, it's three for... games. Sorry. Wait, no, one year probation. From what? Wait, I see one thing that says what? one year probation and one thing that says three game suspension. I don't know what that means. No idea. But all right, how we'll say it's three game suspension. Right, you just right put this whole receiving court just. We have nobody other than you, uh, and uh, maybe Trey Quan Smith. Our our wide receivers looks like um, me in fourth grade. They're practice squad guys, and they are undrafted free agents, and it's so sad and that even it's even Alvin Kamara's like whoop 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 whoop, and then he drops it. Aww. He dropped the pass too. Can't no, he that. didn't. Yes, he did. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. Everybody, go watch the highlights from the game. He did not drop a pass. Um, okay. Anyways, um, now let's talk about our locks for this week. Because again, we were going to talk about some other stuff, but uh, I'm tired and I want to go to sleep. Um, so, uh, so first of all, if you don't know locks, uh, right now he has seven points. I'm negative one. We started uh, two weeks ago. We did not do locks last week. But the way it works, you choose a game and they won, plus one point. You choose a game and they lose, minus one point. Yeah, anyways, uh, here are my locks for this upcoming week. I got Ravens over Dolphins. I got Bills over Jets. I got Steelers over Lions. I got Colts over Jags. I got Bucks over Washington. I got... Ooh, let me see if I can do this. I'm balancing right now. He's Patriots over Browns. Eye. Cowboys over Falcons. Cardinals over Panthers. Seahawks over Packers, and finally Rams over Niners. Those okay. 10. That's a lot. That's a lot of locks, but I, I feel confident in all of them. I think I'm going to choose a lot, too. All the right. others, not so much. Rams over Niners, um, Seahawks over Packers. Wait. Seahawks, Seahawks over, over Packers. Was yeah, cool. Seahawks over Packers. That was the one I wasn't all too confident Chargers over Vikings. 
Uh, Cards over Panthers, Cowboys over Falcons, Browns over Patriots, Bucks over Washington, Jags over Colts, uh, Steelers over Lions, um, Bills over Jets. I'm not calling the Saints game. That's really tight. And Ravens over Dolphins. Well, we do have time. We do have time. So we are going to talk a little bit about the Saints game. Uh, well, I, I, I would rather not. Let's talk a little. Let's talk we're a probably going to lose. Um, I don't think so. I don't know, dude, with this receiving core. Now, if we get OBJ, totally different story. So, let me explain but, the Titans you know, situation. Even then. So. Um, their diamond, Derrick Henry, uh, has... They also just beat the Rams 28 to the They 16. did beat the Rams. I, I honestly think they might be better with Derrick Henry not being just the focal part of their offense. Uh, they might even be better. Say... I think they might have developed a little bit more chemistry as an overall team. I think they might be better. I think the Titans might be more dangerous for that Derrick Henry. I I would say I would say to the league, watch out because this Titans team will steamroll you if you're not ready. And, and I would be terrified to play the Titans right now. I am this upcoming Sunday. I'm terrified so because scary. this team, this is a Titans team that has nothing to lose. They have everything to gain, right? And they're coming off a big win against the the Rams. I am just I am shaking in my boots. Shaking. Don't look like that. That's weird. Um. Okay, most interesting game this upcoming week to me, Chargers versus Minnesota. Here's why. Mike Zimmer, already on the hot seat. He's lost every single game by like a field goal so far this season. Really makes me annoyed at this point. He's so bad he deserves to be fired. Anyways, point being, this is going to tell me, because the Chargers have been winning close games, right? And Minnesota's been losing close games. Minnesota's 3-5, and five, Chargers are 5-3. and three. This is really going to tell me if the Chargers are really all that, which I don't think they are. Because listen, listen, mm. one, one last thing. They start off the season so hot, and they fell off since then, really. Even five, like five and three is still good, but they've been like, let's see, two and three since then? Or no, two and two since then? Like, really, really shaky. Mm. So, I would like to see this Chargers team succeed. I really would, but I don't have all the faith in the world in them. If they edge out a close one against Minnesota, uh, so I'm listen, not going to feel too good Sam, about that. Sam, I, I would definitely... Minnesota um, should win. I think Chargers will win, as I demonstrated in my um, locks. But still, just, I feel like I feel like they're hungry. And they know they can. They definitely can beat the Vikings. Well, I mean, if they played each other 10 times in a row, eventually the Chargers would win, yes. I don't know who's going to win that game. Should, I just think it's going to tell me a lot. That's why I think it's the most interesting game of the week. Um, and with that, I think that wraps it all up. Ladies Sorry and for the shorter video, but one more thing. Thank you so much. We have surpassed a cumulative 10,000 views. Pretty good. Pretty good yeah, and uh, thanks again, folks. Uh, enjoy your day. Enjoy your night. Uh, and uh, peace out.